When it comes to mining, a lot of you seem to be having issues when it comes to actually use the programs and some of the miners are getting deleted. Today I'll be showing you how to whitelist and exclude the executable files to run the miners in order so that you can use them without them being deleted. Stay tuned. Okay, so I know that some of you were having issues, especially when it came to unminable and miners that are downloaded for unminable, that this was being deleted or the file was automatically being deleted once downloaded. And that is because you do not have an exclusion or the path of where you're downloading the files on the whitelist of your antivirus program. So I'm just gonna show you quickly how you can do this. Now, it all depends on which, which antivirus you are using. I have currently a combination of Windows Defender and Avira, but if uh, Windows Defender detects that you're using an external antivirus, it's going to use that instead. So in Windows Defender, you would go to Virus and Threat Protection, and here you, you would have uh, settings for the real-time protection, and you can manage those settings, and then go to the Exclusions section and add your paths there. So for this demonstration, I can show you on my Avira because that is what I am using. So I'm gonna go and open up Avira and that's going to open up the dashboard. I'm gonna to go to security and I'm going to go to protection options in this case. It's gonna be a bit different for yours so it depends on what you're using. Real-time protection in my case on the gear, okay? And I've got an exceptions option here, and this is where I add all of my exceptions. So for example, for unminable, that is currently in the path H colon mining. So what I've done here is I've literally just excluded H mining and all of the folder. So I don't have to do it every time. I would also recommend you to exclude the C downloads path or wherever you're downloading your file, which would normally uh, be the downloads folder of where you're downloading. So in order for you not to have files deleted, this is what you have to do. I am showing you on Avira, but it's going to be very similar for other antiviruses as well. If you are using a particular antivirus and you cannot find the option for this, let me know down in the comments below and I will do my best to help you out. If you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, please do so. Please give me a like. Until next time, do take care of yourselves and thanks for watching.